Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in if it's your first time. Just wanted to share a quick overview of this Wolf watch winder. It's a Wolf Heritage 2.1 leverette watch winder, single winder as you can see. They're very nice, very quiet, almost silent actually, as you'll see in a second when it fires up. So nice and quiet, could easily have it on a bedside table, don't think it'd deserve you, no, it wouldn't deserve me anyway. So very nice. The glass front on it, keep the dust out. Overall it's a very nice unit. As I say, it's not real leather, it's a faux leather. Battery operated and mains, it does come with a mains charger. I prefer to use the batteries in it. I'm not too keen on leaving things plugged in, especially when you're not at home. So I'll run it under on the batteries. It's very nicely done, nice shape. Nice little buckle on the front. It's super quiet it looks like, it's almost silent once you put the front up, you can barely hear the motor at all, whether that will get noisier over time. Several options with a winding function, so at the moment it's on unidirection, but you can have it on either left or right if you wanted to. And there's a 12 hour time delayer on it, you can turn it to that might fire up for 12 hours, which is quite good. Overall the quality is very nice. did have a mark just there, I thought it was a scratch in it actually, but I've just wiped it and it actually was a bit of re glue residue what was been left behind on it. And just on the top, just here, there's some tool marks I think they are where it's been put together, not so visible on the film but in, it does feel just slightly rough there. I believe the retail at £390, I was lucky and actually got this chucked in with a recent purchase. I don't think I'd pay £390, to me it seems an awful lot of money for it. I would have thought it £250ish, something like that would have been a bit more of an appropriate price point. although. All watch winders nowadays seem extortionately expensive for what they are, but it's it's lovely. I do really like it. I've got it on a shelf at the moment, and I'm thinking about changing one of the other ones. I've got I've got a cheap one. I'm thinking about trying to find another one of these second hand to match it, one each side. Cuff goes in and out, nice and easy. Now you just spring, that push that together, it's on a spring system, just pushes together. Just slip the watch over on the front. Seems to hold it nice and tight. Occasionally I've noticed when you put it in, sometimes when it rotates around, because it doesn't snap in that tight, as tight as what you would think it would. But it seems to hold it, but sometimes when it goes around and get it to do it, you'll notice it just slightly wobbles a, a slight bit. I don't know if you can pick that up, but the watch is, does slightly move on the cushion. Don't seem to be doing it so much on here. When you put one of the heavier watches on, sometimes you can notice when it goes and drops there, the watch actually moves each time. So the spring could do with being a little bit more powerful, I think, on the cushion, just to hold it tight. Or maybe the watches just need to be tightened up on the strap a slight bit more, I suppose. But nothing to worry about, just an observation with it. 
Yeah, overall very pleased with it. Most over the moon with it being so it was uh, included in the purchase. But yeah, if you're in the market for one, definitely check out Wolf Watchwinders as a brand. I've looked at a few of the ones in the shop. They've got a couple of uh, different types, some of the newer ones. I believe this one might have been out for quite a while now, hence was it was probably chucked in with it. But I've got some that have got almost like a pyramid top on in British Racing Green, and they would look really nice, they did. You can get them with a compartment at the top here, so you can store a couple of watches in there, your straps, bits and bobs, and then a watch at the front. Look really nice. So definitely a brand well worth checking out if you're in the market. Perhaps a bit expensive, you can look around for a deal on them. Thanks for tuning in, if you've got any questions, drop them in the link below and I'll give you a shout back.